Let's look at how to run the DeepSeek R1 thinking model locally or offline using JAN.AI. With JAN, you can run AI models locally without any privacy concerns. It works in a similar way like using LM Studio or Olama to run models locally on your machine. To get started, you should download JAN for Mac, Windows or Linux. Once you download the application, you have over 71 AI models to test and run locally. With Jan, you can connect with different AI models locally and chat with them. It also has a model hub where you can access different models from all these providers like Mistra, Llama, Microsoft Fi and more. You can also connect to cloud AIs by using your OpenAI API key. You can also connect to a local server and chat with the available models offline. There is also an experimental feature with this feature, you can attach files like PDF for retrieval augmented generation. Let's launch it and run the DeepSeek R1 thinking model. Once you launch the application, you can go to the panel on the left. Over here, we have the hub. With the hub, you can access different models from different providers. If I scroll down a bit, you can see here we have DeepSeek R1 Distal Llama. We can also use the search and put, for example, Deep. You have noticed we have these DeepSeek models available. I have already downloaded the DeepSeek R1 Distal Llama 8B model, so we can click Use to use it in a new chat. With the model selected, we can click the Settings button for Advanced Settings. Let's use the model without modifying the settings. I will go to the browser and copy a prompt. We have two particles of masses 3 and 5 kg, moving with velocities 4 and 2 meters per second in the same direction. After collision, the bigger mass moves with a velocity of 0.8 meters per second. So we want to find the velocity of the smaller mass. Let's copy everything and paste the prompt here. Then we send the prompt. You have noticed the model has started thinking and solving the problem step by step. So once we send the prompt, it will go through a long chain of thought before coming up with the actual solution. So it is now calculating the final answer. You have noticed it went through a very long chain of thought. This took about two to three minutes to arrive at the answer. I have already checked it, so six meters per second is the correct answer. It took about two to three minutes because this is one of the characteristics of reasoning LLMs like the OpenAI O1 and O3 models.